स्टार्ट विद दिस क्यू पाइथन थ्री एल देर इज कंसोल ऑल्सो ओके द इंटरेक्टिव मोड इन विच वी एग्जीक्यूट ईच स्टेटमेंट सो इफ आई राइट हेयर ए इक्वल टू टेन सो वैल्यू टेन विल बी असाइन टू वेरिएबल ए बट नाउ इफ वी वॉन्ट टू चेक दिस वैल्यू दैट इफ दिस वैल्यू इज लेस देन एटीन यू कैन नॉट वोट इट इफ इट इज लेस देन एटीन यू कैन नॉट वोट इफ इट इज ग्रेटर देन एटीन यू कैन वोट सो फॉर दिस वी मेक यूज ऑफ इफ स्टेटमेंट ओके इन दिस वी ओनली गिव वन कंडीशन एंड इफ इट इज ट्रू द स्टेटमेंट्स विल बी एग्जीक्यूटेड इफ इट इज फॉल्स द कंडीशन स्टेटमेंट्स विल नॉट बी इवेल्यूएटेड सो इफ आई राइट ए इज इक्वल टू टेन ओके एंड देन आई राइट हेयर इफ ओके दिस इज अ कंडीशनल स्टेटमेंट द फर्स्ट टाइप ऑफ कंडीशनल स्टेटमेंट इफ द वैल्यू एट एट इज ओके एंड द मैसेज इज ग्रेटर देन एटीन ओके एंड हेयर यू ऑलवेज पुट अ कोल इन मीन्स इट इज इन कंटिन्यूशन एंड यू राइट हेयर प्रिंट ओके एंड देन इन डबल कोड्स राइट वोट और एलिजिबल कैंडिडेट फाइन और एलिजिबल टू वोट एनी मैसेज यू कैन गिव योर एंड दिस फाइन नाउ वॉट इज हैपन दैट इट इज गोइंग टू चेक दैट विदर द पर्सन इज एलिजिबल टू वोट और नॉट फाइन एंड आई राइट हेयर कोल इन सो सी दिस इज गोइंग एन सिंटेक्स एरर एंड इफ आई वॉन्ट टू गो बैक दैट इज नॉट पॉसिबल इन दिस interactive view so what i can do is i can do this in editor that is your script mode and if i write here print a is equal to 2 and i want to give space here for print i'll do this and i run this so see i get the value true here okay so like this that if value is this you can check the condition and if i check right here the condition suppose if the value of 8 is 1 okay and then print true so see now you're not going to get any statement as an output because we have not specified any statement in case if it is false look now okay and now so you can make changes in this script mode very easily so now here only if i want to specify in case if the condition is false then what so you can write here else okay and colon and you can change the message give a space and type print find print in this any message you can type within this condition is false okay in double quotes in this so if a means 10 is less than 1 then true message should come and if it 10 is not less than 1 then condition is false should come so see you will get a message here condition is false and if i change this value here okay if i change this value if i change this value to 11 suppose so now this condition is true so the first will be statement will be executed and you will be getting true as an output so if it is going to check the condition if it is true then the first condition will be executed and if it is for a uh, false then whatever you specify in else that will be executed fine so this is if and else statement there is lf also so when you want to specify multiple condition in that you make use of it so if i write here okay if a is equal to here i have specified value of a is 10 if value in uh, this variable a is equal to 1 then print a message suppose the message you want to print is monday fine and then instead because you have to specify multiple condition so you will not write here else you will write here lf fine lf and then the condition that if, if the value in a is equal to 2 in that case what message you want to print is you want to print a message here see now i can even undo it from here 
this is the advantage of working in script mode okay tuesday fine and now again lf like this you can specify multiple conditions okay if a is equal to 3 then what give a space and then write print okay not this one lower case print print and in this double quotes write wednesday fine so like this you can specify multiple condition in elif and the last one is your else statement so you will write here else okay and then colon here and after all this you have to write here colon okay and else you can write here what you can write here print okay and in double quotes you can write invalid option the last you want to have to specify this fine and then this done all this is done now when i'm going to run this i've specified value of a is 10 so see you're getting an option invalid option as an answer so now if i change this value of a is equal to one suppose and now if i'm going to run i'm going to get monday as an output can you all see if i'm going to write here change here that the value of a is three in this case you will be getting the value wednesday as an answer fine so look in this what we are doing we are fixing the value of the variable even what you can do is you can even ask user to enter the value here also so for that you make use of input functions and you only want integer value so you should write there int int okay and what kind of value you want user to input the value with the message suppose okay so i'll write input number okay see message can may vary there's no problem how you write a message now at run time you have to it is asking input the number so if i input the number i can use my keypad to enter the number in this 